Okay, here I am, and we're looking at a cedar chest. And as you can see, it's uh, really dried out. I wiped it off with a damp rag, and I used a magic sponge to get some little um, scuffs and drips of paint off of it. And I may have to go over this with some really fine steel wool to remove some more. But what I want to do first, because you can see that most of the problem with this piece is extreme dryness and scratches. And so it looks incredibly horrible. All right, what I have here, I've got a rag down there, a clean rag, and I have a mixture of linseed oil, and my brush looks really bad, but that's really not gonna matter. This is linseed oil and walnut stain, okay? And I'm just gonna try to get this piece looking a little better. So take a good look at this, and let's see if we can improve this. And I'm gonna pause this for a minute, and I'm gonna brush this over with this mixture. Okay, I wanted to show you what this looks like. Now, I've just taken this small area and singled it out. And I tried to make sure, and let me show you what I did here with this, find the right brush. So one of them's kind of stiff. I just made sure that I went in the direction of the grain. What I want to do is get this oil in this mixture to penetrate the grain as much as possible. And I want the oil to soak in. And I'm not really trying to get a lot of color, but using the color to cover up the scratches. Because without the color, I'm not gonna get the scratch coverage that I would get with just the oil. It will certainly affect the piece, but I certainly wouldn't get the, the scratch removal that I would, would get with the color. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is take this rag, okay? And I can let this sit a little longer and get just a little bit more color out of it. But I'm going to wipe this. And just show you what happens in this particular situation. So you can see the difference. Okay, now look at that. Now you've got a completely different piece here. This is compared to what you've got here. Look at the edge. I done just a little bit of this piece here. I didn't do any of the front. You can see how it just, how the vibrance came back to this piece. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna continue to do this to this entire piece, going over areas as necessary. And if needed, I will add um, a little bit more stain to the mixture if I come across an area that seems to need like a little more scratch coverage maybe over here where I've got some deeper scratches and I will just continue doing this until I've brought the vibrance back to this piece after this has had time to penetrate then I can go over this with some furniture wax and seal it in and rub it really good and buff it and it'll give it a nice fresh shine all right so we'll come back and show this piece again in another video so stay tuned Subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.